Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the closing performance of Grant High School Performing Arts Department's 2008 production of Beauty and the Beast. There will be a 15 minute intermission. And now it is my pleasure to introduce the musical director of the Beauty and the Beast Orchestra, Mr. Nicholas Budge. Rose, which would bloom for many years. If 
a court learn to love another, and earn her love in return. <coughs> By the time the last petal fell, then the spell would be broken. If not, he would be doomed to remain a beast for all time. As the years passed, he fell into despair and lost all hope. For who could ever learn to love a beast?
get your head out of the books and start paying attention to more important things. Ha! Hip, hip. Like you. Exactly! It's not right for women to read. Soon she starts getting ideas and then thinking. Gaston, you are positively primeval. Well, I thank you, Bill. You know, what do you say you and I take a walk over the town? Take a look at my true rupees. <laughs> Why do you say we don't? Oh, come on, Bell, I'm pretty sure I know how you feel. You can't even imagine.
Well, now, he's done a day, told you not to let him in. We could not leave him for the wolves. Is anybody there? If we keep quiet, maybe he'll go away. Is somebody home? Not a word, Lugier. Not a word. I don't mean it's true, but, well, I lost my way in the woods and I need a place to stay for the night. Poor fellow. Oh, God's word. Have a heart. Monsieur, you are welcome here. Well, I, I've lost my way in the woods. You are not welcome here. I'll just 
Oh, 
Thou hast that is my wife. Make no mistake of that. Yes, who was I can see it? 
the West Wing. Why? It's forbidden. You will never accept for there. Do you understand? Do you understand?
Plagues you spell? Of course I have. I'm a fool. Cool. So? You fall in love with her. <coughs> she falls in love with you. What both? The spell is broken. We'll be human again by midnight. Yeah, it's not that easy. These things take time. But we don't have time. The walls has already begun to win. It's no use. She's so beautiful. And I'm... Well, look at me! He has a boy. <laughs>
fights the horse. Suit the jaw, hot or dirt. Why we own it if to serve? That's why I say place that. It's delicious! Don't believe me, ask the dishes!
sadness come to good on their own. So if you know what you see, see a few days more, there may be something there that wasn't there before. Perhaps there's something there that wasn't there before. What? There may be something there that wasn't there before. What's there, huh? I'll tell you when you're all done. Come along, son, let's give them some privacy. Yes, Jim. Will I get to be a boy again? I hope so. When will I know? Soon. If it's to be, it will be very soon. Come along, son. Knowing not that this was indeed the legendary sword called Excalibur, Arthur tried to pull it from the stone. He tried once to no avail. He tried a second time and still could not pull it out. Then, for the third time, <laughs> Arthur drew forth the sword. And now let's look at this game. Wait and see. <laughs> do that. Do what? Take me away from this place. Make me forget. For a little while. Forget? <laughs> Who are you? What I am. You and I have something in common. In the town where I come from, people think I'm not. Yes. So I know how it feels to be different. I know how lonely that is. Then, for the third time, Arthur drew forth the sword. And there arose from the people a great shout. Arthur is king. Told you so. <laughs> this
tonight. Tonight you confess your love to her. The truth is you must. You must. You care for the girl, don't you? Or is it anything? Then why not tell her? I can't. You must. There will be beautiful music, romantic candlelight, provided by <laughs> my friends. And then, when the moment is right, how shall I look at the moment is right? You feel slightly nauseous. <laughs> no, no. You will know because you will feel it here. And you must speak from the heart. You must speak from me. I can't. You must. What are you afraid of? Nothing. Master. I'm afraid she might. Oh, she might what? Laugh at me. Somehow, my prince, you must find the courage to take that chance. Master, look at the rose. There's so little time left. <laughs> what shall I to do this? Here, this might help to bolster your courage. You can do it, Master. I know you can. Beauty. 
speak from the heart. There's something wrong.
go. Tell me, Maurice, how long have you been having these delusions? They're not delusions. The beast is real, and so is the talking clock. <laughs> about your father. Gaston, you know he's not crazy. Well, I might be able to clear this little misunderstanding up with him. If you want. Will you marry me? What? One little word, Belle, that's all it takes. Never.
it was. No, it wasn't. It most certainly was. No, it wasn't.
after Miss Drago, whoever she is, could you please come in front of the audience? She's not here, so never mind. But... <laughs>